Yay, I finally got my own bike, my own beach cruiser to ride around on all these wonderful bike paths around the ocean and the bay. So I got on the internet. I'm, I'm starting to really enjoy shopping on the internet, I have to say. And I went on Amazon <clears throat> and I found this vintage it was a baby blue bike. It had like the camel handlebars. It had like the Pee Wee Herman. I don't know if you am probably dating myself, but Pee Wee Herman had his red bike with that back a little holder on it, the rack and then I was looking for that for my bike. That was on it. It had the basket. And it was uh, only like, oh gosh, I'm going to say $185, which was good, you know, delivered free. And so I ordered it and I, there, the next day they're like, oh, we're out of stock. I'm like, oh, you know when you get your hopes up and you're like, oh, I can't wait to go buy. So I went back on and I found it on another site. Another uh, business had it and I ordered that one too. And it's like, that was out of stock. Three times I tried that bike and it was out of stock. So obviously I've got good taste because everybody else wanted that bike too. So I thought, you know, I am just going to go and do a different kind of bike. So... I am back on the internet looking and I find this really great bike. It's right behind me. You can only see the handlebars. That's a sneak peek. But I found a bike that was uh, called Women's Tahiti 26 inch beach, beach Cruiser Coaster. And I thought, okay, it's got the pink rims. It was a vanilla in color. And had the fenders. Um, I have to, it didn't have the basket or the racket, racket, whatever little doohickey in the back. So I'm going to have to try and find that too. Now that one, what was that price at? That was 200. This is 236 dollars, which you know it's not bad, and it was free shipping. And the problem was I had to put it together myself when it came. I thought, okay, I, I know people maybe that can put it together if I can't. I, and Callie, my daughter, she's a great, she was a great Ikea put it together. I said, with her and me, we can probably figure it out. So I get my bike. It's in a box. Most of it's together, the, you know, the body thing. But you had to put the fenders on. Let me just, let me get, you know, let me show you. It is just really beautiful. See? There it is, my bike. I'll show you it up a little closer in a little bit, but you had to put the fenders on, you had to put the pedals, the handlebars, the seat, the uh, a lot of stuff. I, I, you'll see in my video, they got the silver things that oh, it was okay. This was the manual I got, it was um, McCarthy Bicycles, of course, Cruiser Bikes, and it was the worst instructions ever. ever. Fur. I will went through it. The, the thing is, when you have instructions, especially for girls or women, you really have to have color photos, like what does the yellow go over the silver? See how awful, awful it was. Just, it, you can't tell anything. And then they cut like half the photo off. Not good. So I'm going to take you and show you a close-up of my mess. Okay, so this is the bike I'm talking about that I got from Amazon. And I, I should have uh, took a picture of how it all came. I have since taken off plastic and everything, and I've actually put the fender on. But um, the fender I got on backwards because I had this little doolip over here. And I sent a picture to my friend who was a guy. He's like laughed he goes oh my gosh he goes you got your fender on backwards but in my defense these instructions are awful 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 and i still got more to do in fact i just i give up it's they there's no color photos of anything let me show you like look at this you can't tell like on here you got these silver things do they go on the outside of this, where's my wheel? Like you have to put the wheel on, right? So it's like, I had my wheel on, well it goes on the inside, but with the wheel on, it's like these things, uh, do they go on the outside of the yellow? Do they go on the inside? And there's two on each side. 
and the directions say nothing of how they go. Look, there is nothing, just, it's, it's, it's terrible pictures, and it's like the ink is all blotted together. It, it, it's awful. They should be ashamed of themselves, and who is this? This is a Tahiti, well, it says Tahiti, who's the manufacturer? There it is. Makarji Bicycles, Cruiser Bikes. Uh, I don't know where, um, let's see. I don't know where they're from, but, uh, um, it's just awful, awful, awful instructions. You guys should be ashamed of yourself. I'm not for sure where you're out of. I'm going to do a little research. I bought this bike like for $249, so I would hope that the instructions would be a little better. Now, here's the whole bike. But look, they they very are very stingy with how they label it. And and once again, you can't tell where the silver spokes are right there. You know, do they go in, out, around? It's it's just awful. And if a girl's trying to put it together, it's not cool because they don't put bikes together and send them out, you know, on the internet. So if you order one, you gotta find somebody to put it together. And there's the rest of my parts. So I'm just, you know, yeah, I gotta pay a friend to come over and put it together. And had it been better directions, I would have been, because I put IKEA together lots and lots of times. You know, the tools are all pretty simple, but the instructions are just all black and white with ink spots together. You guys have to remember, girls are putting this together. In fact, my friend even said he's seen girls riding their bikes, like with that fender backwards. Like, see this little curve, I guess, goes back. I had it back here, and he back here, and he said he's seen so many girls with that, and he, he laughs at it. And I even have my fork backwards, because that twist, that little fork, and that they don't show you either. Look, there's not even a fork of how that goes right here. It's like... Somebody just drew half of the drawing. So, not too happy with the directions. And once again, it is this company, McCarty. So, shame on you. I think you need to get somebody else to do a little better instructions. Definitely. So, that was my mess. Not cool, huh? But I had a friend come over, he put it together for me, he's done a lot of bikes, so I was really, really, really happy with it, and I took it for a spin, and it's, it's really a nice bike, but it was all worth it, and I probably would have hired somebody to put my bike together, but most people, you guys can't hire your own person to do that, and let me just, I'm going to flip this around and give you a really good close-up shot of it, okay? There it is. That's my bike. It's very, it's really, really comfortable. I don't know if you can zoom in the pink tires. Got my reflector on. But this is the part that I wanted that little rack on right behind my seat. So I have to find one of them. If you guys know of any place to buy one, that would be good. It's, they call this vanilla, but it's almost like a yellow. A light yellow, but I, I like it. It looks really vintage. It's got the pink uh, accents that they did. Love it, but uh, as you can see now, unlike the picture, these silver things went on the one went on the outside of the yellow, and the other one went on the inside of the yellow. But you can never tell, and how me not being really good at putting bikes together I needed to know that because see the back silver is all different too that just goes on the outside right there but but yeah that's my bike I want to get a different uh, front headlight one that flashes so I can ride it at night and took my tires to get filled so, and did you know it's like a dollar to fill tires up out here for just air? I'm like, oh, crazy. Anyway, that's my bike. 
I love it and I will use it almost every day because it's always nice nice here always and it's good exercise which we all need every day at least a little bit of it some of it but you know all I'm asking is that people who are bike manufacturers I'm sure there's many of you that have excellent instructions and maybe it was just this particular company that didn't but it would have made my life easier and I would have got on my bike sooner had your instructions been a little more detailed, a little more colored, and I would have been much happier camper earlier. But I'm happy now with my bike. I love it, love it lots. And I hope that if you get a bike and you have to put it together, your instructions are a little better. Otherwise, uh, just comment below. I'll, I'll tell you how to put it together now that I watched him do it. Maybe I can help you, but I hope not. I hope that you can uh, actually get a bike assembled, which I would have, but I, like I would go to Target and everything was like just really, really sold out. So that wasn't cool. And you know, it just, that's why the internet, there's always, you can always find a bike on there or anything else you're looking for. So you don't have to go store to store and waste your gas and all that. So anyway, that's my bike. I'm sticking to it. I love you guys. Bye.